Back in January of this year, if you had told Gregory and Ebony Lohman that they would be advocating for their son during Childhood Cancer Month, they probably wouldn't have believed you. Trey was normal two-year-old like any other kid running around playing full of life and energy. Love dancing, singing. Earlier this year, the Lomans noticed that something was off with their son. March 7th, we took him into the ER, um, and we learned on that day that he had a brain mass. Trey had an extremely rare brain cancer called atypical teratoid robotoid tumor, or ATRT. That was only like one or two percent of all uh, pediatric like you know, brain tumors. That's super rare. It was probably one of the um, scariest moments I've experienced in my life. Trey immediately needed surgery. Six rounds of intense chemotherapy followed, and the treatment was so intense that Trey would need stem cells to recover. He unfortunately has had the rare instance where uh, the stem cells did not take initially. The Lomans then began their search for an African-American donor, but they ran into a problem. African-Americans have a higher chance of not finding a match out of all ethnicities. Luckily, the Lomans ended up not needing a donor, but now they want to help spread awareness. They're hosting a donor drive at the Burnett Avenue Baptist Church on South Hirschborn Parkway later this month. So there are two sets of swabs they do on each in, inside of your cheek. It's for like 15 to 30 seconds, it's real quick, and they do each cheek and then they send it off. That could have easily changed everything for our family, and I don't want that to be something that another family has to deal with. Addie Miners, WLKY News.